You might know Rich Clooney as a hockey player. You, you might know him for his Instagram workouts, and you might even know him for his famous tattoos. But did you know Rich Clune also an actor? He joined the cast of an independent film this summer shot here in Toronto, and it premieres tonight at the Regent Theatre. You are in control. character in this uh, film, Bipolar, what is, what is the process in bringing that character to life on screen for you? Well, you know, I mean, I, I, I don't necessarily, I was, you know, my heart goes out to people that you know, struggle with bipolar and there's so much that goes into that, that dis disorder. Um, it was a challenge, I mean, you know, I did my best. Uh, I have a lot of friends that, that struggle with bipolar, you know, I myself am not bipolar, but um, you know, it was a process. It was doing research, talking to people, uh, you know, taking the script. Um, Cameron did a great job on the script writing it. And I think the film in, in its entirety is its own character, you know. The hypostasis film is trying to depict, you know, trying to take you on a ride as to what it is to be bipolar. When you see him invest so much of himself into a, an acting role, is it a little bit different? It's different in that I've never seen him in a movie before. Uh, I've seen him interview. I mean, he's been, you know, doing acting, taking acting classes for about four years in the summertime. As a child, he, um, after school, took art class. He always, and he was in the choir as a very young child. So he's always had that side to him. But for Rich to go into this, I think it's amazing that I think it's amazing when people have layers to themselves. Rich Clune, a choir boy at one point, <laughs> right here. Yeah. Colin, I, just an incredible thing. How, how much did you know that Rich Clune could be an actor? Well, actually, I found out this summer he was talking about uh, he had been doing some acting classes and it was a hobby that he picked up, I think, in Nashville. I mean, he mentioned it before. So uh, we started talking about it, and he was taking it. He took some acting classes, and you know he felt like he was getting good at it. And and then this summer, um, you know, he mentioned that he was doing this short film, and that he, uh, you know, it actually was quite a process. From what he told me, was you know he had to audition for it, and so he got the part, and so good for him. You know, we're all here to support him, and so uh, it's gonna be, be a good night. Cappy, oftentimes we think of hockey players. That's all we think about. But you know, for you all have depth. You all do other things, but. An actor? Can you believe Rich Clune? Uh, for sure. I mean, he's, he's, you know, he's something else for sure in the locker room. He's, you know, always entertaining the guys. And, um, you know, I'm really proud of him for doing something like this. You know, he's a tremendous, tremendous uh, hockey player, but also a great human being. So, uh, you know, I'm really uh, excited to see his movie and uh, I'm really proud of him. He's going to help some people here, too, as well. Uh, who, who are you hoping to help with the film? Well, an immediate beneficiary would be Cam H. Uh, we're doing a presentation tonight with some money that we've been able to raise um, from making the film, which I'm most proud of. You know, I think, uh, like I said, a lot of people talk about, you know, talking about stigma, but the world we live in, money, you know, putting money behind it is, is the real deal breaker. So with the money we raise, maybe somebody will get treatment, you know what I mean? And that can change one life, so.